All right, good morning, welcome to the day. And I think it sounds like a good idea to start the day off with a ride with Mater uh, and these tractors. Do some tractor tipping. I like the song, it's really jazzing me up. Anyways, let's have some fun today. These are the Holstein Heifer 2 Alls. Anyways, we'll hop in this one. Oh, here. Uh, Oh, hold on. It's Jessica and JR over there doing their thing. Oh, yeah, this is going to be whipped around. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is like alien swirling saucers where you get whipped around. Whoa, you feel like you're going to get hit by another tractor. Whoa, watch this. Look how these tractors get close together. It's going to look like we're going to get hit in a tractor. Oh, don't, don't, oh, don't, don't. Oh. <laughs> from cars over to the Avengers campus. I think we're now, now we're gonna ride this Guardians of the Galaxy ride again. Mission Breakout, cause it's really fun. All right, so yeah, that is a fantastic ride. Uh, not just an old retheme of, of Tower of Terror, that stands on its own for sure. That was really cool. Wow. Uh, just Black Panther just casually walking through. That's cool. So we worked up a little bit of a thirst from uh, the Guardians of the Galaxy mission breakout ride. So came over here to Pim's Kitchen. And Jessica got this little flight thing here where you can pick four cocktails or four... Uh, whatever's from Draft. Oh, whatever's from Draft. Okay, gotcha. So that's pretty neat. And I, I just got a beer so I can get a little bit refreshed here. It is really cool to take a break every now and then just to see, you know, just take a look at things around you because, you know, usually you're walking around and, and you miss some of the details that they put into to the theming here. One of the things that's enlarged is in this little bar area, they have these Christmas lights. And actually, over at the actual bar area, you can see that the, the actual beer is coming out of a, a beer can that they've enlarged. So that's pretty... Ooh. Oh, something's happening. Anyways, that's pretty, uh, pretty cool. Oh, there's a battle. All right, that was good. Oh, wow. Holy moly, look at it. You met the Falcon. like really surprises me is the the trees like they're very different the trees are very different I don't know it's just one of those things that I noticed that the trees are really cool one of the other surprising things that I found that I didn't think I would be excited about that I am is not the bakery tour in particular but thank you very much but the bread associated with the tour this is amazing this is a fantastic tree so this bread is made with the mother dough there wow like i can't believe how good this bread is it's better than like a snack like not a snack but like chocolate or something yeah oh yeah it's got a good pull to it yeah not, not the crust that. is flaky crunchy the not center is flaky. chewy and oh so delicious mm. and they're making it right over here this is fresh bread It's really fun, because look at these breads. Look, there's a Mickey bread and a Baymax bread. Oh wow, there we go, there it is, the Baymax bread. A lot of birds here, which is pretty neat. But anyways, this San Francisco area is really cool. And at night, it is absolutely like popping, like all these tables, all these tables, all these open tables right now, not gonna find that at nighttime. But right now we're gonna go across this uh, bridge 
the San Francisco Bridge. Pretty cool. Let's do this. <laughs> oh, let's do that. Yeah, we'll do one of these. We're gonna check out some of these boots. Uh, they have these uh, boots for California food and wine. Different foods, drinks, snacks, whatever you want to feel. Whatever you're feeling like. You know how, the, how it goes. Anyways, just a little change of pace. We're gonna ride the uh, Little Mermaid ride. Is it the same as, uh, is, this, is this the same as a Magic I Kingdom? Oh, all right, let's find out together. Gonna, oh, okay, we're all three gonna fit into the same shell. They weren't kidding when they called me well a witch. As you can see, everything worked out swell for Ariel. Of course, sometimes I do. All right, so that was the exact same ride, I think. It's pretty much exact, but it was still fun and cool. And need to do in a place that's different than our own. All right, so we just had these wings that has been a little bit of controversial. Uh, it seems like it's been a little controversial from this like Moo. What's this place called? Moo something. Moo cow chicken. Popcorn? Moo cow chicken. I don't know, but it's it's basically it's it's a cheese pizza flavored wings, which sounds like it could go either way. But I gotta say, a lot of the videos we've seen are people of just saying they're just like, meh, or almost dissing them. I don't know, I thought they were pretty dang good. <laughs> it was a good wing. Like, it was like meaty, like the, the, the wing was actually cooked well. Uh, it wasn't like tough, or it wasn't underdone, or anything like that. It wasn't too crunchy. It wasn't too much like crust on it or whatever. Like, it was a well-balanced wing, and the flavor was, I don't know if it tasted like cheese pizza flavored wings, but they were good wings. But they were good wings. <laughs> yeah, I thought they were actually really good. We almost didn't get them because we thought, ah, everybody's been saying they're not great, so maybe we shouldn't get them, but I'm glad we did. That was a good wing. Those are good wings. You all work together to make something better than the original. This is the moment we've been waiting for. When we add up the spicy, the smooth, the crunch, and you know, we turn it into something more. Might not seem like they go together, but there's something you may not know. If you sprinkle with a little bit of magic in the kitchen, then it all becomes sort of a... You know, I don't really know what the gather is kitchen sink. Oh, patience. Ha ha! Okay, well, uh, go, enjoy, and taste everything, because food, like life, is a celebration. All right, so now I guess we're gonna do these zephyrs. Oh, we're jumping right on. Not even a line. Five minute wait, basically a walk on. All right, so we're on Rocket 5 on the Golden Zephyr. It's not golden, it's pretty silver, but it looks really cool. I'm gonna get in here. Oh, uh, yep. Uh. Okay. Get buckled up here. All right, buckled up, looking pretty solid. Okay, that's what the buckles look like, is these guys. A bit of that buckle action. We're gonna have a humdinger. A humdinger of a flight. Right? Humdinger of a flight. Look at us go. Enjoy your flight. All right, we're about to enjoy our flight. Oh, okay, here we go. All right. Humdinger of a flight. All right, wow, we are really swinging around. Oh, wow, this is, oh. boy, we are, we're kind of out there a little bit. Can you see that? 
you see? Oh, wow, we are out there. Oh, look at that. We're out there. <laughs> oh, boy. We are really out there. Thanks for flying the Golden Zephyr. Neat. All right, Golden Zephyr. We flew it. We flew the Golden Zephyr. What do you think about that? That was awesome. It was pretty okay. awesome. It, great views. Welcome back, guys. It was you great views. Your rocket Not as scary as I thought it was going to be. I'll let you know. All right. Next up, time for Goofy Sky School. This right here. It's kind of like Primeval World, just without the world. Still pretty wild, though. That's right. It's pretty cool. It goes up really fast. Goofy Sky School. Oh, oh boy. Ugh. Whoa. Alright, the rest of it will be oh, oh. crazy ride. A little bit rough. Student pilot though. Whoa. Whoa. Alright. Oh. Okay. Oh, you're now graduates of Goofy Sky School. We graduated. Alright, so this Pixar Pier is pretty fun. Lots of peas. It's prominent with the Pixar promenade. Permanently permeating all of my proximities. <laughs> oh, what am I even talking about? I don't even know. But in any case, it's a lot of fun. Oh, wow. We'll say that ride is pretty rough. We rode it once. Probably will not ride that one again. I kept knocking my head against my ears. Not knocking my head against my ears. Like my head was like burr, 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 bouncing around. My ears kept slamming against the side. Quite uncomfortable. The Incredi coaster. That one. Mark that one off at least. Now I've said it before, but I'll say it again. I do like the way that a lot. Of, oh, look, there's Bo Peep. Wow. One of the things that I've said before that I will say again is that I like the way all the ride like cues are outside here because it's out in the. The Florida, not the Florida, but the California sun. By the way, the California sun is weird because in the sunshine, it's actually very warm. But as soon as you get into the shade, it's actually quite cool. Like you need a, like a hoodie, you know, jacket, whatever. In Florida, even in the shade, it's like really hot. What a fun place this is. I do like it here. Pretty cool. So we're heading into the Lamplight Lounge area. Uh, pretty neat looking inside of here. Look up. You can look up. We're looking up. But anyways, yeah, we're gonna get a, a neat little waterside view, which sounds pretty cool and looks pretty cool. We are gonna share this nachos barbacoa. That's a good looking nachos right there. JR got the 2319. The 2319, there's a sock in there, 2319. I got the Sunrise Spectacular, whatever this is, Sunrise Special. I found the sock. What? The sock. The sock, okay. <laughs> All right. What'd final you... with a twist, I think it's called. Oh yeah, final with a twist. Pretty good. Yummy. Woo. All right, so Lamplight Lounge, that was pretty good. But now we're walking through San Francisco, and earlier, all these tables were empty. Now they are full. And this is pretty much how I think it is until basically the end of the night. Because we came here pretty late last night, and it was full still. But anyways, we're gonna go through Cars Land, through Marvel Campus, and then over to the Hollywood Land area because uh, we're gonna go to Mike and Sully. We're gonna do some stuff. We're gonna go to a thing and do a thing and go to the stuff. Wow, look up there. Oh, wow. Okay, anyways, 
Yeah, we're gonna walk through uh, Cars Land. We're gonna go through Marvel Campus and over to the uh, Hollywood Studios area where we're gonna get on one of the rides that we haven't ridden yet, which is gonna be Mike and Sully's. Apparently this is some sort of a Monsters, Inc. type of ride in the, not the lap floor, but the, the door factory. So that's pretty neat. Hello. If you are new to the area, the Monstropolis Chamber of Commerce would like to, to welcome you. but it picked me up with its mind powers and shook me like a doll. It's true! I saw the whole thing! Oh, oh, we gotta get you home. There's a kid here! A human kid! It's a Grizzly River Rafting Company ride, but uh, me and JR, oh wow, we really are just walking right on. This lightning ring is pretty cool. All right, we'll see you on the raft. Legend says that uh, the people right by the opening get the most wet. Yeah, that's me. A lot of racket. Yeah, pretty racket. Peak up there. All right. Okay, we're going now. Oh yeah. Oh. All right. And that, my friends, wraps up an unforgettable day here at Disney's California Adventure. From the thrilling heights of the Incredicoaster to braving the Grizzly River Run, let's not forget those incredible flavors we've discovered along the way. Thank you for joining me on this adventure. If you enjoyed this journey, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more magical content, ring the bell to never miss a moment with us. But until then, keep dreaming, keep believing, always remember, 
adventure is out there. But until then, see ya. Thank you.